That's what I have to say about it. Close enough. Bones. Hooray for bones. Seeds. Did I leave a workbench up here? Oh, yes I did. Okay. Need more sticks. Need... Ho! Oh. Gained a rail. I don't quite know where that came from, but I'm gonna put it in here. Oop, another rail. What is that all about? Whatever. I need to... Get bread. Which also means that I need bone meal. That'll give me ten bread. That'll do for now. Ooh, gotta put the bone meal on the bar before it expires. The seeds expire. Or the ground. Fuck! No! Whew! Cool. Everything's cool. Boom. Saw that coming. Okay, well, these creepers do not want me to make bread. Fortunately for them, I am too persistent. What I need is a giant lake of water. Creepers, get a life. You hear me? Get a life. Okay, I don't have a whole lot. I should have enough to at least fill up my food bar for the moment. Um... And hopefully a little bit extra. And then I'll delve over in the supermart. See if I can't get a hold of the buckets. I think they were in there. I hope so. Probably do want to make some more bread. Yeah, because I pretty much just used it all. But... Speaking of... Stuff, I didn't leave myself any like I don't have a bed I have I'm two strings short of making one though and there's two spiders over here okay well string it's a shame I lost all that uh, all those levels I had though really is a big pity but oh well but I'm going to make a bed. I'm going to save myself here because I have to... Whoops. Making a bed is not going to do me any good if I don't make this... The... Basically, I can't make a bed without the wool. I still have enough string left over to make... Uh... A whatchamadoodle. Yep, a whatchamadoodle. A... Fishing pole. Hopefully nothing attacks me. Switch to my sword, just in case. Okay, we are good. I think I'm gonna leave this bed here. And break my legs. The creeper's following me. You know, you'd think if the sun is there, it would burn things through here, and that wouldn't just be a dark shadow still, but it is. The hell? Did you guys hear that noise? I heard that noise. And I wasted a bone mail. I didn't put my bones away like I should have either, so... That's smart. Dry farming! With Zinder. Quite possibly very boring. But I'm 
doing what I gotta do to survive. Even though I've already died multiple times. But I'm doing what I gotta do to survive. Hopefully I left useful stuff in some of the chests in the, uh, super mart. And I'm gonna have to check... Oh. You can go ahead and blow up out here if you want. Oh, too late. I gave you a chance, and you didn't take it. God damn your pressure plates. I have a bad feeling that one of those pressure plates is supposed to be hooked up to something explosive. Hey now. I know you're still spawning in here. Bad. Stop it. Okay. Oops. Okay, I emptied that chest. Which I'm going to take for good measure. Oh, there's two chests in here. A oh, bow. Perfect. Some wood. Uh, it's as good as wood, so there's no point digging it. A steak, chest piece, and boots. See, this is one of the reasons why you leave things behind. You never know when you may come back through and need them. Uh, more wood, more wood. What the hell with the hoe. Double chest with some wood. Although it's going to end up as a different color and it's going to annoy me. I heard things walking. What's in here? There's a chest at the end. How you doing, skeleton? Can't path to me so you don't care about me, huh? Nothing in there. Oh, there's a chest in here. Yep. Re-exploring somewhere we had already explored. Ah, no, bad time for an itch. Okay, itch solved. Spider also solved. Nothing there. Double chest up here. What do you got? Chest piece. I think the one I'm wearing is leather, so I should probably take that just in case. Uh, another chest... I think there might have been one more chest along the side. The chain doesn't seem to die out too quickly, but I'm still going to take those. And I'm going to chop straight through these planks of wood. Melon! Pretty sure I've already pillaged all the food in this area other than the melons, so dry farming wheat is probably going to be my only source of food for a while. But unfortunately the buckets did not appear to be in there. So I'm gonna have to go back through these places too, because apparently while my sense of direction isn't absolutely terrible. My ability to remember where things are located is. Do not want... Actually, kind of want the eyeball. Emergency rations. God damn it. Picking things back up. Did I ever check back here? Because I never even noticed this was back here. Eh, nothing there, though. Let's see. Nothing. Guess not. I really, really do not want to go the whole way back through the uh, little school area, so I'm going to avoid that. Melon helmet. Wood. Yeah, I knew you were coming after me. More bones. Now, I know I definitely took all the food out of those, but I still have to check them. Workbenches. Which is good, because I have wheat. Wheat! Depending on who you are. 
Okay, I have food. It's not a lot of food, but it is food. And I've got the bare necessities. I've got a little bit of armor. I've got weapons, all the tools, including a hoe. Bone meal. And I'm probably going to make a little bit more bone meal to take with me. And then put the bones back. I want to use up the rest of the bone meal that I had on me right there. So... Maybe I'll just put the bones away, because I'm bound to kill a bunch of these fuckers over here. Hey, you. Arrow to the face. Face. See? Bones. Could you stop spawning, please? Okay, I'm just going to charge this one. Okay, see? Bones. But I will end up picking up more bones, so I'm just gonna say, tell with that. Store probably most of the seeds. I'm gonna keep some bones and some seeds on me as emergency tools, as well as that dirt. Because as long as I have all of those, I can make food on demand at any time. So, I'm going to put... I'll put seven of the bones in here. Put Ward in there because I don't have the thing with me. Stash the chain boots. Things a little bit more organized. Make one more piece of bread. This hasn't been a very eventful episode, I know, but things kind of took a turn for the worse. I'm going to keep that string on me, even though it's also fairly easy to come by. Keep that as wood, just in case. Turn these into sticks, because I already had some, so I'm not really losing space to that. Sand, don't need it. Get away from me. Stone bricks, I'm going to keep them as a building material, so. Let's head along this little path here. I see you down there, Mr. Sheep. Head along this little path. Keep an eye out for any random hidden buildings. The TNT should only be activated via... Okay. Maybe not. Woo! He must be using, uh... Monster plates, basically. If that makes any sense. That, that's the word I'm going to use for them. Monster plates. You walk within range of the spawner. Maybe there was just a pressure plate that I missed somehow, but I don't think that's likely because uh, there's nothing actually connected physically to the rail. So it has to be a uh, monster triggered pl pressure plates. Like uh, monster spawners so when you get close enough, triggers a pressure plate and sets off the TNT. So... I'm going to be careful of that, but all I have to do is sprint really quickly the moment I hear the TNT hissing. So, that'll be fun. The hell? Whatever. Don't know. Don't care. Sure is a lot of tree. Sure is a lot of lack of world loading. Load? Don't load. I've heard of fraps causing lack of loading issues. But I'm not going to stop recording for a second like everybody else does. I just don't care. And I'm still walking, so... Doesn't matter too much. Should have brought the bed with me, but I guess I'll just have to kill spiders or something. That looks kind of like a main highway or something right there. And that road splits in that direction. I'm wondering what's over that way. If there's anything. But I'm going to... Hmm. Ugh. Against my better judgment.
I'm gonna circle around the long, long way. Take this cactus. Guess I'll need some sand too. Problem solved. I want to see what's down at the end of this road because if you were to ride the minecart, you would not end up on this road. You would end up somewhere else. And therefore, I must know what is down here. It's probably a road to nowhere that Vex put in to troll me. Not specifically me, but you know what I mean. So far, it definitely looks like a road to nowhere. Floaty leaves. I wouldn't, be, ugh, I wouldn't be surprised if there was things on the sides that I cannot see due to, uh, um, so what I'm looking for, not being loaded. Oh, what is this? It probably says something like, road closed, map border, turn around, go away. Road ends under construction. Is that so? I'm going to guess I'm not supposed to go this way. Of course, so this will also be another one of those places that I will keep track of. Yeah, I'm guessing this is normally generated terrain other than he kind of threw in little bits and pieces of sand in it and whatnot to make it look kind of not complete deserty but desert esque. And, but that, just look at the trees, they're so cut up and irregular. So, I'm going to stay away from that. Who knows, maybe he'll tell me that that is a bad place. Maybe he just wants to see if I explore that. There's nothing, I know you're not supposed to leave the map boundaries, but I don't really know what indicates map boundaries, to be honest. I don't know, maybe if I run out far enough, I will find out what map boundary stands for. But, uh, what is this sandstone house? I'm gonna go right through this guy's fence. Right through his fence. Don't even give a damn. custom pictures is on the wall. Arr! Gotta light that up. I like my cat picture. I pixel arted that picture in paint.net. Which if you've seen my uh, texture pack showcase of my texture pack that I threw together, you probably already know this. Oh. In, uh, on that topic, I heard a pressure plate. I don't hear any hissing. Pants. I hear things falling. Here, a pressure plate. And it worries me. Food, 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 food. No food. Why are you doing this to me, Vex? Yeah, I know. I'm not in any real need for food. I have a way to generate it on demand. No, oh. I could get red mushrooms. Quite possibly the most dangerous